Let's take some live pictures outside. A very busy day at the stores and out on the roads. A live look right now at our skyline there. You could see the freeway moving pretty freely. And then you see SAC International where some people were traveling today. We found some traveling after getting the vaccine or already having the virus. Here's CBS 13's Rachel Wolf. Okay, it's got my date of birth. My, Dr. Um, Jukjit Carr showed us her proof of vaccination before stepping on a plane to New Jersey with her kids. Yes, we have a lot of physicians in our family. So, but we just got lucky. So my dad, uh, myself, my mother, my sister were, I yeah. think, probably the first family that got vaccinated all together. Yeah. Carr feeling confident, along with most others at SAC International. I mean, I'm not too worried about traveling. I take precaution. Um, I trust the airlines. This financial analyst from New Jersey who had COVID back in March is heading home for the holidays. He's one of 85 million Americans expected to travel between now and the new year. That's 34 million fewer than last year. Yeah, I test uh, before I travel every time and when I land as well. There are some worried about taking flight with a spike in cases and the governor's stay at home order. They didn't want to talk about it on camera, but they are taking the necessary precautions, like this teacher from Stockton. We're going to Denver. Or down on the ground. Well, I mean, I haven't seen my family for like a year or two, so I'm not as well. I'm, I'm going to see my family. I'm sorry. I mean, everyone just got to do their part. This family has all been tested before they head from SAC to the Central Valley, and they will wear masks once there. They say some older family members have opted not to attend. Everyone hoping the arrival of a vaccine will ease everyone's fears. Dr. Carr glad her family is protected. So on the back, it gives a date when we have to come back for the second dose. And soon the public will be too. So the travel industry and tourism will take flight once again. Well, according to SAC International, travel was down about 65 to 75 percent prior to the Thanksgiving holiday this year. Yeah, travel was down 50% during the Thanksgiving holiday, and the airport expects that again for Christmas.